Mandata. My daughter. If not for anything, I'll say you stay here with me. You are really helping me. In fact, my son does not know what is missing. He's there complaining. Hmm? But you must go back. I mean, you should complain. Not everybody would be childless and be happy. I understand him. You are not childless. You are just waiting on to be married. Hmm? You are not childless. Don't use your mouth to confess negative. Negative things in your mouth. What? Yeah. Yeah, later, I'll use scent leaf to do this one for you. Mm -hmm. Hello? How are you? What? When? But I just spoke to him yesterday. How come? Annabelle, this is bad. Bad. So Malik is no more. God. My goodness. This life is nothing. Thank you, dear. This life is nothing in this life. I don't believe my leg is gone. How? Oh. How can you just die like that? Hello? Yes, this is she. I won one man eighty thousand. How? See, I don't remember entering any promo. Last month. Okay. My ex boyfriend entered his yes. Okay, I will just um, look for the receipt and where? Office. Okay, please just uh, send me the address. I will, I will look for the receipt where he gets it. Yes. I think Karen should have pulled up promotion. Is Mango her? Honestly, we've worked so hard for that thing. So hard. Remember last year, I really had my hopes up because. Those um, product advertisements you secure, they were major. Of they course. were really major, of course. Yeah. But you know, Mr. Okoro, regional manager, he won't disappoint to fail. Whether he likes it or not. You see, this time around, he's not dashing my hopes. Hello, gentlemen. Hello. Hi. Hi. I am said I should drop this file with you. It's for the meeting slated for next week, Monday, with White House Company. Yeah, but you look dashing and beautiful. Thank you. And smashy too. This felt 
are very urgent. <laughs> See sheep. Huh? Who she was saying about uh, this shit? Do you know oh, every say? girl is so hot before your eyes? How is your wife? So that was what happened. I was so embarrassed. Here. You're not a stranger, but you're my visitor. So I owe you that hospitality. Drink up. As well with home training, I'm yeah, you talk I'm gonna drink up. Please. <laughs> I know your husband would be proud of you. Hmm. Speaking about your husband, how is he? Alex is fine. He goes out too early these days. Too early. I hope you guys still do your morning devotion before he leaves early. That's the problem, you know. Alex is working for his promotion in the office, so it doesn't give him time. So he leaves and I end up doing the devotion alone. Yeah. The race is not won by the swift. Exactly. But just hold on to God. And I promise before the year runs out, you will hear the cry of a baby in your home. Amen. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. <laughs> How about the meeting? Anyone contributed yet? No. What is wrong with these women? They're waiting for me to call them. No, you should call them. I'm not calling anyone. You have to call them. I'm not wasting my credit on anyone. <laughs> One idea. <laughs> you are back from church. Yes. Yeah. One idea. <laughs> Hope you have taken your medications today. I have with the mama. I have, but the medication seems not to be working. <laughs> the joint pain is much. Don't worry, it will subside. Eh? Hey, you are you? Yeah. But you know I'm a strong woman. You are, you are, you are. Uh, don't worry, just make yourself comfortable here. Mm. Whatever you want, either from inside or anywhere around, just let me know. Mm. I don't want uh, anything. Uh, how? Oh, no, I'm a man. Eh? No. Sorry. I am by one young. I'm a man. Sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I said I don't want anything. Oh? Why? <laughs> Our son. Yeah. When did he say he's coming to see us? Ha. Huh. That one. Uh, I don't know. He promised coming next weekend. But I don't know whether anything has, anything has changed in his plans. You know your son Alex can be very stubborn sometimes. Like his father. <laughs> I know that is what you will say. <laughs> hmm? Now he is stubborn. He is like his father. Or when he behaves fine, he is the mother's carbon copy. Hey, mom. The mom be corrupt with my eh <laughs> 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 Honestly, baby, I can't wait for your promotion to come. You're really digging hard. I hope so too. My iron is just this thing. It will come. God will do it. Mm. Honestly, I miss our morning devotion together. I know it will come to that. Of course it will come. But you see, we need to pray, uh, even if it's for 10 to 30 minutes every day. It will yes, help in us. Yes, yes. uh, you know how tight my shipping is. So I, I, I barely have time in the morning for that. Moreover, who told you I don't pray when I get to the office? <laughs> it's fine, I won't push it. 
and we, we have a new neighbor. Anyways, Papa called. He wanted to know if we were still coming by the weekend. He said he was calling you and you weren't picking his calls. I was busy then. So are we still going? I don't think so. You should be the one to go because um, my hands are full now. I have an urgent document to deliver by Monday, so you'll be the one to go. Look, if it's just a, a, a day or two stay, we are not staying for long. Please, please. Should you allow me to sort out what I'm doing? I'm too tired for this kind of talk. You'll be the one to go. Don't push it. No problem, sir. Good night. Good night. These can mean so many things. <laughs>
morning, my neighbor. I guess you just moved in. Good morning, sir. Yes. Okay, I'm just your next door neighbor. Oh, okay. My name is Alex. I am Linda. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> You're welcome. It's nice to meet you. You're welcome. <laughs> it's actually my pleasure to meet you. <laughs> You're, you're, you're very welcome. Thank you. Yeah. I hope you're enjoying the apartment. I mean, yes. it's a peaceful... Yes, yes, yes. It's a peaceful place. You will like it. Uh, you will like it. You're, you're very welcome. Uh, thank you. Please make yourself comfortable. Uh, <laughs> wow. You're welcome. Hello, Papa. Uh, good, good morning, Papa. I'm um, so sorry I, I couldn't return your call yesterday. I saw, I saw it. I couldn't return it. I was busy with work. Yes, yes. How, how are you and Mama now? Papa, please, eh? Uh, please, please. I, I, I can't make it. I can't make it, but uh, patients will be coming back to see you people. Uh, she will be coming to stay with you all through the weekend. Um, she, she can even she can even stay more. She can she can stay more. She can stay more. Uh, she can stay with you guys even for one week. No problem. No problem. I promise to to, to make it up when I can. Oh, Papa, Papa, eh? Please tell Mama I will send those things through the uh, patients. She's coming. I promise you that she will stay with you people for long. Eh? Work is too much. Work is heavy on me, Papa. I won't have that chance. Work is heavy on me. Please. Please. Oh, she will, she's coming to stay with you people. Yes. Yes. Uh, she can stay more. She can stay more. No problem. Thank you. Bye, sir.
sorry, the other day I was in a hurry, so we couldn't really talk. Fine. Um, is there a problem? Uh, no, no, not at all. Not at all. I <clears throat> I thought that we may be needing some help since um, you just moved into your apartment, so I wanted to help out with them. Um, I don't know to arrange maybe your gen or your gen set, mm -hmm. uh, the 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 frames on the wall. I don't know. I don't know how you want to make <laughs> your apartment. I just want to help out. How? Well, that's very trustful of you, but the caretaker already helped me put out things in place before I arrived, so um, I won't be needing any help. <laughs> Jude, you mean the caretaker? Yes. yes. He's always not in his business. <laughs> but I understand. I understand. Um, but at least can I come in? You know, I'm just trying to be a friend. No, no harm intended. I don't buy it. I'm just trying to be a friend. My daughter, no marriage is perfect. It is a gradual process. You are not the same mother, you are not the same father. You came from different places. Are you getting me? Even same mother, same father is always a problem to be together. Not to talk of two persons coming from different areas. It doesn't matter. When the time comes, everything will be okay. Oh? When you don't take care of your own, at the end of the day, it rests on the wind. So try and package your own. Oh. I'm trying my best. God knows I am. But I feel sometimes his love for me is dropping. Maybe because I've not given him a child. Are you God that gives children? Listen, I stayed eight good years before I gave birth to your husband. And my husband was so patient. Yes. So calm down. When the time comes, you will have your children. You will give me, you will give me male, you will give me female. Eh? You don't have any problem, only. Mama, leave me because you have a way of making me feel so comfortable. That's why I'm your mother. Are you sure he feels the same way? Don't worry. Don't worry. It's because of the way you're taking things. Like I said, package your home, when you package your home, you will come to Paris. What? Thank you so much. Thank you. Hmm? Mm -hmm. You see, it's my leg. Huh. Yeah? It's my leg. It's giving me serious ache. Serious ache. Well, Mama, does rheumatism have any cure? Uh, it's management. It's management. I take an adjustment all the time. So be is management. Ah, you oh, Sorry, Mama. Oh, sorry. Oh. Some men are just so blind. Honestly? You mean, as beautiful as you are, <laughs> you're not married, you're not engaged, you're not in any relationship. What are all the single guys doing? <laughs> I don't know, but I have had fair share in relationships in the past. Don't really look like it would stand. Men will always be men. No, no, no. I, I refuse to accept that. I mean, some men are lame, yes. I'm, I'm, I'm an exception to that, though. <laughs> because I don't think any man in his right senses, I mean, would joke with someone like you. You are too pretty for any man to ignore. Mm. <laughs> I don't think they deserved you. Story of my life. <laughs> That's by the way. So, um, tell me, what do you do? Are you married? Are you in a relationship? Well, uh, I work with an advertising firm. And, uh, yeah, unfortunately, I'm married. Um, it's not really that. What? That's just it. I think um, <laughs> that's pretty, yeah, unfortunately. Yeah, um. Why do you unfortunately? 
Don't you live with her? Well, uh, as to the why, that's a story for another day. Okay. Um, yes, I live with her here, but she travelled to the village. Oh. She'll be there for a long time. Okay. But now, I'm just there. So, tentative, like I can say, I'm single. So what um, what do you do? Well, um, I just finished uh, from the fashion school in Ghana. Well, hoping to open a, a boutique here. So can I help you? Thank you. That's nice. I mean, um, it's it's wonderful. I mean, I like seeing. It's a thing for me to see beautiful, hardworking ladies. It kind of turns me on. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> um, I hope to, you know, support you in any way I can. I mean, build your dreams for you. Are you serious? Right here. Are you serious? Yes. Wow. That would be really nice. <laughs> <laughs> it would be my pleasure. Oh, I really appreciate it. But... I hope your wife will not break my head. I don't have a problem. <laughs> <laughs> but that's not going to be the case. Yeah, because um, hard work will always beat laziness. That's my policy. And uh, you know, some decisions one takes early in life, or rather, some choices. We make early in life sometimes um, requires somebody to come into the picture and then you'll be able to rectify those choices that you're not totally convinced about that it's life it's life it happens so i really hope to mend that fence when the time comes I am not sure I baton your point. I'm sure you will get that as we move along. Aaron was very angry with you yesterday. He was not happy that you lodged the money into your personal account. But that was because I didn't come to work yesterday. The moment the contact person called me from White House, I had to make the arrangement. So, have you paid the same money back into the company's account? I have reimbursed everything. That was the first thing I did this morning. Oh, okay. Okay. <clears throat> so, how is your wife now? Because that is what the secretary told me that kept you away from work yesterday. I just had to squeeze that in when I couldn't get through to you because I tried to call you. It wasn't about your wife? James, listen. There's this my new neighbor that just moved into the compound. Boy, oh boy. This lady is a beauty goddess. Very pretty. The very first day I set my eyes on her, boy, oh boy. For complete five minutes, I couldn't breathe. I was not breathing. 
And then she she literally took my breath away. She is too pretty. In fact, she deserves for me to take the week off. But I just managed to squeeze her one day. Oh, oh my goodness. I can't believe we are talking about this. I mean, where was your wife when all this were going on? I was in Mugu. Am I in Mugu? Eh? My wife traveled now. But aside that, you know me. You know your guy. I have a thing for beautiful, hard-working women. This lady is a sight to behold. She's, she's a delight to the world. Oh, she's, she's pure, pure gift to mankind. Mm -hmm. Please, just remind me, Alex. Why did you marry your beautiful wife? Please, don't go all sanctimonious on me now. We're talking men's talk here, you just want to ruin it. Okay, okay, fine. Before we delve into men's talk, let me remind you that this is an office. This is our office. And we have so much work here to do. We are supposed to be brainstorming to come out with strategies on how we can market it. Organ vocabulary. Let me understand something here. Is it that no more on a wild speed is too much a born or talk? Calm down, take a chill pill, please. Eh? Drink some water. Open every time. Walk, walk, walk. What is it? If this will be of help to you, let me tell you that. A dog cannot eat a bone that is hung around its neck. James, a motivational speaker. One, please come here. Please pass me the damn flash. All this plenty, plenty talk. I don't know why you like walk past your life. Huh? Sometimes, change joy. Oh, I don't want to no life. Don't know your problem. Yeah, kid, you have speed. You can't cast with speed. Eh? Small boy like you, you already old. You can't go cast. You can shout and party everywhere. Because you are too focused on work. Sweat, 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 work. Eh? White hair, they do here. I'm already here. Yes. Oh, <laughs> look at you. Come, I'm waiting for you. Hello? Where? Okay, you're closed. Okay, hurry up, I'm here. Babe, shall we? No, 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 hold on, I'm waiting for my electrician. He will soon be here. He wants to come and fix up things in my house. That's fine. fine. But babe, so if I didn't ask you, you won't invite me to your new apartment. <laughs> Look at this one. How many times have I invited you, but you're there forming busy for me? <laughs> anyway, I hope you're prepared to wash the house with the fish we buy for me today. Hmm. Annabelle, you are fish, eh? Yes, now. Who's <laughs> calling me? Um, Alex. Uh... Hello, Alex. Please, can I call you back? Okay, thank you. Okay. Alex, please, my dear friend and sister. Who is Alex this time? You too like I'm a boy. Hmm? It's none of your business. You co-op marker. You, you too <laughs> like man. Tell me. <laughs> so, tell me. I'm waiting. Okay. Alex is married. He is my next door neighbor. He just wants to help me fix up things in my house. <sighs> Babe, you have not even settled completely. And they are all over you like bees. <laughs> anyway. The most important thing is, is he loaded? <laughs> <laughs> God, you corrupt Marka. Did you hear the part where I said he's a married man? Uh, and as if that can change the fact that men would always be men. See, my dear friend, do your thing. As long as this guy plays his card well, you have nothing to worry about. Yes, or nothing to lose. Because remind me where I met you. <laughs> anyway, at that lonely path, where my dear friend was looking for a long-time friendship, that knows her like the back of her pants, 
That's where you met me. <laughs> okay. I don't want a game. Huh? Mm. That's too late. No going back. You've already paid for the full subscription, so you have to relax and enjoy it. Is it by force? It's already by force, so. <laughs> but Maka, where you is it? You paid this? for it, not me. Where is this electrician? <laughs> Alex. Uh, hey. But wait, though. You've not answered my question. Biko, happy Maka. Is it by force? We're no longer friends. Where is this guy? Biko, pick up your phone. Yeah, this Hurry up. Come, no let's live friend. here. If you die here, no going back. Yes, you will tell me. How are you? Fine, thank you. You're welcome. I thank hope you. Um, here was not difficult to locate. No, 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 not at all. I mean, I've been here a couple of times. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Alex. Hi, how are you? Sorry, my friend Annabelle. Wow, Annabelle. Annabelle, Alex. My pleasure. Very awesome. My friend said so many nice, nice things about us. Really? Wow. It's a lie. Don't mind her. She's lying. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. So, what are you guys having? I mean, oh. I want us to take something more, <clears throat> you know, mm. maybe fish, mm. Mm. Yes. Mm. Yes. and some drinks. Yes. Mm. Oh, fish just right? had one. <laughs> <laughs> you got to start from somewhere. Wait up. Yeah. Mm. 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 Yeah. <laughs> What's it? What's it? It's okay. Okay, okay, okay. No, no, no. Look at what you're doing. Give me. Give me this. Okay, okay. Okay. Thank you so much for tonight. Oh, I should be the one thanking you for coming tipsy. I almost got drunk. I was drunk, I promise. <laughs> it's alright. So, um, when are we doing this again? No, I'm not doing no. this again. No, 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 Bad, bad, bad company. No. Okay, no, I think that's no, me. You no. enjoyed yourself, right? Of course I did. Yes, <laughs> did I am not right? going to say the law. <laughs> wow. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I'm not I'm you not wrong. No, I'm not wrong. I did. No. You almost got that. No. It's on the way. I am so ashamed of myself. I shouldn't have done this. There's nothing to be ashamed of, my dear. I mean, we are adults. We know what is good for us. There's nothing to be ashamed of. It's so easy for you to say. Baby. I won't lie to you. I care so much about you. 
I don't want you to feel ashamed about anything. It's just me and you. You have to trust me. Okay? I want to make a transfer to you today. So you could get your shop and start your boutique business. Just to show you I care. Excuse me. Are you paying me for sex? I should not call you. Why are you paying me for sex? No. I'm, no, sorry. My dear, I can't. I can't do that. Please. I just want to transfer you money to get your shop so you can start your boutique business. You are a decent human being. And you are a hardworking woman that is independent. I just want to come in as a helper for you. Just to lessen the weight for you. I care so much about you. Uh, it can't be about that. No. No. Please understand. Okay? But I assure you. Okay? Thank you. But promise me this will not happen again. I wish I could cross my heart on that.
once you get to the city, some dry this mangala. Okay. Don't leave it in any bag, oh, <laughs> so it doesn't spoil. Okay. Oh, well, you will open salad. Hello, Papa. Ah, my dear. <laughs> She's getting ready. Yes, I can mm. see that. Mm. It's a good mangala. Mama just packed everything and gave to me. <laughs> you deserve it. <laughs> It's a bit. Hey, hey. Um, my daughter. Uh -huh. Let me tell you something. Always be fervent in prayer. Be steadfast in prayer. I will always call my son your husband to remain steadfast and fervent in prayer too. His mother and I brought him up. We are he cannot deviate from it now. He knows that prayer. Is the key to a man's life. He knows that. Exactly. It is God that dictates when children come in marriage. Oh. So no partner whatsoever or whomsoever should blame the other for lateness of children in marriage. Huh? Papa, God is blessed you too for me. I am so blessed to have you too because sometimes you people make me forget that I don't even have my parents alive. I'm so grateful. Thank you so very much, sir. Like I always say, don't ever be under pressure because you've not given back. No, 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 no. It must come when God wants it. Don't be in a hurry. My dear, I thank God your name is patience. Always be patient with God. Children will come. God's time. So eh? And always maintain a good relationship and communication with your husband. Uh, if I don't come back to meet you, the road will be a driver. Amen. Uh, Amen. My daughter. God bless Amen. You, Thank you so eh? much. Sir. Let me know. Go and pack it. All right, Mama. Uh, get your things ready so I'll walk you to the road. Oh, oh Mama. Thank you. Mama. Asamo. Chai. Let's pray and fire them back. Mighty Holy Ghost, we call upon you at this time of the night. Father Lord, we begin to call forth your spirit to go into the camp of our enemies and begin to destroy whatsoever that needs to be destroyed in Jesus' name. Babies are not amen. Father, we begin to come against whatsoever that needs to be come against. We begin to destroy whatsoever that needs to be destroyed in Jesus' name. Did you see the email I copied you? I, I didn't see it. My internet has been down. I'm trying to get the time. I sent an email to you from White House Company. 
we lost the contract for the second premium product. What did you just say? How? I mean, every document you presented for that contract checked out. It's quite strange. Really did strange. It happen? I don't know. Aaron was very mad this morning. He was angry with everybody in the office. Have you seen him? No, I haven't seen him. This is unbelievable. I already counted that in the bag. I think you need to see your house facilitator. We did everything according to his directions. We even got committed financially. This is unacceptable. Do I start defending this flop before they are here? Where do I start from? It's a problem. This is really a big problem for me. But I say this town is not ready for you. Trust me. My sister, what can I say? Hmm? I had to utilize every cobble. Opportunity they say comes once by you. That's true. That's mm -hmm. true. True talk. But believe me, this guy is the real deal. Anyway, I trust you. Mm -hmm. I'm really grateful you came to me like that. He's indeed a God sent to you. I know. You have to hold this guy tight. Whether he's married or not, it doesn't matter. In this our harsh economy, his type comes in handy. Yes. My sister, I know, but I have to be careful so his wife doesn't break my hair with bottles. You know these days, you can't tell who is raving mad. Mm. Mm. As a child. Baby, you're no longer a child. As long as you play your card well, nothing will happen. Trust me. Do you think if I have this type of man in my life, I will ever complain? Hell no. I am not complaining, but I'm just being careful. My dear, please, what do I offer you? Let me feed my eyes first. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Let me go and get married. You don't need to get married. No, I need to come and oh, buy no, baby clothes single. here. Stay single. This place is so <laughs> classy, trust me. I don't have just babies well. See over there. Uh, yeah. There's this new shoe. I like it. I think you will How first dash, dash me one. No, no, you don't know? dash. Mm. Did they dash me? My dear. Oh, I'm your friend. friend. See that new one? It's Do give me. away for me. You don't only give away. Give away. Give away. This one is nice. I love this one. Yeah, you know the kind of things I love. It's not expensive, just um, 25k. Okay, because of my friend, I'll give you 20. Right? Sit down. I'm not buying it again. What? I just want us to have a struggle. I won't stress you. What is it? You, you want what to be a struggle? The ones I've been, I've been struggling in the past, what, where is the result? To what end? Baby, how can you say this? Am I God? Baby, please, let's have a cow girl in case you don't want stress. I'll do the Please! Right. Can't you listen to me? I said I'm tired. Which part of... I, I, I'm tired. I had a hectic day. Did you not hear? 
time saying these things that things that you're wheezy, you're even suggesting sex ties. To what end? I don't want to start bringing. Yet you complain. What is your problem? I said today I am going to ride you. Don't bother um, stressing yourself. And yet you're still complaining. What the ones that I've been stressing myself, struggling and riding you to what end? I keep my tirelessly on top of you. Keep going on, on, top, on top of you every, every, every now and then. To what end? So it's not a problem for me to desire my husband, right? It's not, is it a problem for you to also give your husband the chance? I am not God. To take him? I am not God. That's why we, we should still try. Neither am I a porn star to keep trying. I'm not a porn star. All you do is to demand for sex in the morning, in the afternoon, in the night. To what end? Huh? I see because, because you, you're, you're always at home, because you're always at home and you have nothing to do, that is why you will always be demanding for sex. Because if you have something to win, you will not have time for, 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 for these frivolities. You think sex is an exercise? You yes. do it in the morning, afternoon, night, and yet you're not putting anything out. You want me to, 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 to be stressing myself? For what? I'm sorry, but let's just try. You, you would like this. I said leave me alone. Leave me alone. I would like what? I would like what? Mind yourself. I'm not in that mood. I want to sleep. I want to go to bed. I don't need it. All this embarrassment. Just because I desire my husband. I don't blame you. God will judge you. God will judge you. <laughs> God will judge me. God will judge me. Because of sex. God will judge me. And you're even crying. You should be ashamed of yourself. You should be ashamed of your incisal demand for sex. Because it's disgusting. <laughs> Just look at him, my husband. Just look at him because I did not my husband. <laughs> Of course, your usual slogan. Maybe I need some money. Maybe if you are the one that is going out there to work out this money, you will know how draining it is to make demands. It's young ladies like you that are hard working out there, making this money without any support for themselves and their family as well. But no, you will sit in my house from morning till night and open up your heart to make demands. Next thing you will kneel down and start praying all over the place without being productive. You think once you kneel down and pray, all your problem vanishes. Need some money to go for checkup. What are you actually checking up? What exactly are you checking up? I'll make you the transfer. Papa, so patients called you to report me to you. <clears throat> Papa, listen, eh? the truth of the matter is that I can no longer condone her laziness. I can't. Her demand for sex is irritating me because we have nothing to show for it. I know, I know that she's not God. I know that she's not God. 
But then, heaven help those who help themselves. That is how the Bible say, it said it. Papa, please, please. You see, eh, I have told her how it is in my mind. If she doesn't like it, then let her find something else. And, 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 and. Papa, I'm not going to discuss this again. Nobody will tell me how to run my life. It is my home. I, I, I'm, 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 I'm the one. I'm, I'm, I'm the one that no, no knows what, what I'm feeling. Papa, let it see. The truth of the matter is, if she reports me to you again, no, if she reports me to you again, I will not take it lightly with her. I will not. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sounding that way, but it, it, it's it's how it is in my mind, and I mean it, too, Papa. I mean it. Let us stop calling you people to report any little thing because she's the one that, that is causing it in the first place. I've heard you. I've heard you. Papa, I've heard you. I've heard you. But let her not call you again and report me to you. Thank you. Why, why are you reporting to them when you are the cause of it all? Lazy, lazy, you, you are lazy, you can't do anything. Yes, I know I'm, 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 the, I'm the reason you, 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 are not, you are not working in the first place. But I thought you had sense. I thought she had sense. <laughs> you know, what you did with that shop is so impressive. I'm super proud of you. Thank you. You know, it wouldn't be possible without you. We're just starting. Okay? And um, you're very industrious and hardworking. So, I'm willing to do more for you. <laughs> you're such a darling. And my God replenish your pocket for your kindness towards me. Has anyone told you your charm is so endearing? Honestly, I I feel so connected to you emotionally. I know I can never have enough of you. I'm certain about that. Okay. Thank you, but no thanks. Um, we've spoken about this already. Uh, you're a married man. I don't want what happened the other day to repeat itself again. Please, I beg you. Beautiful. I know where you're coming from. But you see, I have genuinely developed feelings for you. It's, it's from a place of sincerity. I really wish you would understand it this way. It's not about the sex. I mean, it's not about it. Believe me. It's not about that. That is what it was. Can we please just stop talking about this? You may see me as a married man, but if I'm happy in that marriage, it's an entirely different thing. We are all human beings. In life, we make horrid decisions. 
But those decisions don't define us. There comes a time someone comes along and helps you to correct those horrid decisions. I really want to make you my wife. But But you were happy in your marriage before you met him. What if I told you that's not true? Would you believe me? No. Can we just change on that topic? I'm a woman. Besides, we're just getting to know each other. Think about this. But promise me you spare some thought on it. I just wanted to know I'll be dreaming about you tonight. Your wife might be watching. This man here doesn't care. Let her watch. This lady here cares. And that is why I'll be leaving you now. Good night, Alex. Good night, my love. Maybe it's just me or a mere coincidence. You both got home at the same time. <laughs> Alex, this nonsense has to stop tonight. Else I'll create a scene in this compound. And I mean it when I said this nonsense has to stop tonight. Don't let me create a scene. Don't. So she's the reason for the shady attitude lately. Yet, you berate me for childlessness because you saw a prettier face. <laughs> mm. How low can men go? just to satisfy their randy sexual lord. How? Nothing I do pleases you anymore. Because you choose to think with your groins instead of your head. You choose to be a dog in heat than to find solace in your wife's breast. 
<laughs> Shame on you. Yet you had the audaciousness to open that hole craved on your face to compare me with her. Alex. Need I remind you that you made me quit my job? <sighs> you disgust me. You disgust me, Alex. But I dare you to scorn me one more time. Then I will teach you that hell hath no fury when it comes to a woman scorned. I don't, I'm not interested, can you? Baby, you don't have the right to reject my food. I won't let you do that. And who will force me to eat it? You? Baby, baby. I won't let you ruin our home. I won't let you ruin this marriage. Patience. I am late for work. I know. I know. Baby, see, I am sorry for what happened yesterday. I was angry. I've never been that angry since I lost my parents and my siblings in, in, in one day. I'm sorry. Beginning to sound all obsessed about me. I don't like it one bit. For God's sake, this man is married. How does he want to make you a second wife? I don't know. He keeps saying he's not getting the fulfillment from his marriage. As if he was going to meet me this lifetime. This is serious. B, you need to be very careful. But if his marriage is not working out, he should end the first one before entering another. I think I'm so careless at times. Girlfriend, you know I'm too enlightened to become somebody's second wife. At this time and age, mm -mm. it's not happening. That's true, that's true. I agree with you on that one. You know, I'm thinking I should give him space. Because I'm not called out for any unnecessary drama. Mm -mm. Thank you, Bart. Mm, I have a business to run. I don't need drama in my life now, please. You just said it all. Besides, it's not even that loaded for one to be in the middle no, of such melodrama. No, drama. you understand? Yes, it's not called for. You get the point. Please forget to let's talk about something I'm else. Telling, please come and buy black soap. Mm -hmm. Black soap. Last time you're looking for giveaway. No, see, stop it. Just stop it. Don't play with my business. My wife is really getting on my nerves. Women are just so petty. Imagine her calling me names simply because she saw me coming home at the same time with Linda. The same lady you told me about? Yes. Linda. I mean, she, she, she was acting like she caught us already on bed. Uh, she may not be far from the truth. Stop that rubbish, James. Don't, 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 don't switch up on me right now. I'm telling you this because I want you to understand my point. I am a man. I can get married to as many women as I want. She has not even given me a child and she's demanding heaven and earth. Alex, you are my friend, my very good friend, and I will not lie to you. It doesn't matter how it is happening today. Don't allow anybody to ruin your home. Change is the only constant thing. The situation on ground notwithstanding. This is what you can sit down as the man of the house and settle with her amicably. My wife is just being self-centered. Yes. Because I don't understand why she should be monitoring me up and down. Is she an evil spirit? Did you, did you just listen to yourself? See, this is a dangerous and sleepy path you are about to take. That even if you must take, it has to be as discreet as possible from her. As the guy man that you claim to be. You can't be doing this under her nose. It's humiliating. I mean, put yourself in her shoes. Has she put herself? In my own shoes? Has she? Has she given me a child? What if she's not able to give me a child at the end of all this charade? No. Is this how my lineage will close? 
Oh, no, you haven't thought about that. You haven't. I don't want you to sound like that, please. Even if it has been proven medically that she cannot give you a child. I mean, this is something both of you can sit down and agree on the next step to take. If you continue like this, you just end up cheating on her continuously and you will ruin your home.
Hello, baby girl. Oh. Hello, Alex. You're welcome. How are you? My thank you. <laughs> so nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Yeah. Sit down. Thank you. Ah, it's been so hard seeing you lately. What happened? Is it business or me or what? Yeah, business. And you too, you've been busy with work. And likewise, me. I've been very busy here. That's alright. Um, I got this for you. Some chocolates. Oh. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's thoughtful of you. Thank you. Like you. It? Yes, I love it. That's nice. Thank you. Hmm. I always like what I see around here when I come. <laughs> I mean, you put so much into this business. It shows how diligent and hardworking you are. Mm -hmm. I like it. Thank you. You know, this is the only thing I do. And the new business needs a lot of efforts to make it stand and grow. I see. I see. There's something striking about your hardworking ability. Yes. <laughs> it beats me every time. Thank you. That's so nice. Thank you. That's good. Well, I just popped in to say hi. Okay. How about we see you later tonight? This evening? I don't know when you round up. Ah, yeah, I'm sorry it's not going to be possible because um, today I've been tired. We can only do for another time. Um, okay, that's fine. That's fine. I mean, um, you didn't plan for it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, I... Okay, that's fine. Thank you. Um, I, I didn't ask what I would offer you. No, 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 I'm okay. okay. I'm okay. okay. I... I wanted to ask about what we discussed the other time about us. Um, I don't know if you've given it a thought. I was waiting to hear from you. Okay. Now that you have brought it up. I will tell you this. Please, I don't want to catch him feeling over what we did the other time. I appreciate you, yes. But I cannot see myself becoming somebody's second wife. So I beg you, please. I would want you to respect my opinion. Ask me to turn back now. That would be suicidal. Linda, I have feelings for you, true feelings for you. I really want to make you my wife. Please, this ends here. I can see you don't have regards for my own decision. At this moment, I would really love to be left alone. Excuse me if you don't mind. I'll be I'll be on my way then.
Are you are you are you crazy? Are you mad? Eh? Will you take it with the money to, to, to open this door for me? Eh? Sorry, I, I came to Shut you. up! You are very stupid. Lazy thing. Now you keep lazing up and down day and night. Keep knocking on the door before you come and open the door for me. You are lazy, you are also you are also stupid and useless. You dare not call my name. You dare not call my name. Are you mad? Is something wrong with you? Eh? You're calling my name. Try it next time. Idiot. Then you keep messing up. Carrying your bad luck up, up and down. Is this your bad luck that sent your parents to their early graves? Think you can fool me? Alex, let today be the first and last you will call my parents. You can insult me all you want, but don't you call my parents! Did you? Did you talk back at me? Eh? You raise your voice and you are talking back at me! Patience! You! Let me My friend, behave yourself! What is your problem? You push me! Patience, you push me! You, you push me! What is your problem? Oh, get out! You're so shameless! My take that out of my nose. You are! <laughs> ah! 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 Patience! You push me to the ground! <laughs> you push me to the ground! Patience! You! You! Patience, you push me down! Patience! You push me down! Bet it! Bet it! Oh! I said I don't want to see you by the time I get back to this house. Are you listening to me? Patience, read my lips. I am done. I am totally done with you. I don't want to see you. I don't have any need. For you, this marriage, this sham God marriage is over this morning. If I see you by the time I get back here, you won't like what I will do to you. I said you are useless to me. Don't try talking to me. I have no need for you. Did you hear me? I said I am not your love. Just leave this house. I don't want to see you. Get out. Get lost. You are a bag of ill luck to me. You are just a barren witch. I don't want to see you. This relationship, this marriage. It's totally over. And I, as I listen, I said this marriage is over here and now. Love, can you listen to me? If you don't, I'm, so, I'm very sorry. If sorry. I get back here and you've not left this house, I won't be responsible for what happened to you. Baby, baby, can, can we just. Oh, God. Hello, Papa. Good morning, sir. Papa, we are not fine. Alex asked me to leave the house. Yes, Papa, we had a little quarrel yesterday. Very little quarrel. I didn't know it was going to result to him telling me to leave the house. I'm still in the house, sir. But I'm even scared, so I'm packing my things because if he comes back, he will, he will beat me up. Oh, 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 okay, Papa. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. All right, sir.
So that was exactly what happened before I called you, Papa. Hey. What has come over Madabuji? What has come over him? Eh? Did he suddenly become a drunk? Um, the mom. Huh? We need to send for my son. I want to talk to him. Something is wrong somewhere. Something is really wrong. We need to send for him. No, I doubt he will listen to anybody. There's this new lady that moved into the compound. She's been his distraction. The reason he's doing all this. Eh? Yes. A new lady? Yes, sir. Ah! If that be the case, he has to come home at really? once. Eh? Mother, uh, because I did not bring him up in a polygamous way. At all, no. Mother Mary, you just have to intervene. This is very, very unusual. Very unusual. Hey, Mama, if you're in a That was why I ran back home because he said if he comes back and meets me in the house, he will beat me up. <laughs> Don't worry, we will talk to him. Thank you, Mama. God bless you. Talk to him. Down. There's nothing unusual about this. I mean, I'm not that man a woman would dictate to how he lives his life. What? I mean, it has not gotten to the point of sending her packing. It's not called for. How do I even expect you to understand me? Yeah? I'm the one wearing the shoes and I know exactly where it pinches. Well, I do not mean to run your life for you or judge your actions. But as far as I am concerned, the decision is extreme. You don't want to judge my actions. But that's exactly what you're doing. Yes, forgive me. But why do I have this feeling that you are doing all of this because of the girl we spoke about? That's not the case. Linda has absolutely nothing to do with this. Patience disrespected me and it's not the first time she's doing it. So I'm taking, in fact, I took the appropriate decision I'm supposed to have taken since. Well, at the end of the day, it's your life to leave your decision to make. I can only advise or suggest where I see it ideal or necessary. Thank you very much for realizing this vital fact that it is my life, my decision. Because I've been the one suffering her, her laziness, her insults, her childlessness. For once, let me fight for my lineage. Period. Can you sit down? I'm not in the in the video to sit down. You can say what you want to say. I'm listening. Hmm. It's all right. Mm -hmm. Abuchuku, I called you here today as your father. I have discussed with your mother. We have listened to your wife, patience. And we have heard your own side of the story. I want to tell you something. Any palm fruit that wants to become a palm oil must be ready to pass through rigorous poundings and through fire. There is always a price tag in life, and you are not supposed to give up early. Look at your mother here. How old are you now? 
Since I married her till date, nobody has ever come into this compound to settle matters for us. The big animal often surfaces by the time the hunter gives up on the day's hunting. Madam Bichuku, what I'm trying to tell you here is that you must have to settle whatever differences you have with your wife, patience, here and now and in our presence today. Well, Papa, I was waiting for you to learn it. With all due respect, what you are asking of me, I cannot do it. <laughs> I'm telling you frankly because I, there's no need beating, beating about the bush. You see this woman here, she's not coming back to my house. She cannot try it. Papa, if she leaves this place and follows me, what I will do to her, she will not believe it. I am done with this marriage and that is final. It's a wrong way. Mother Abrachuku, it's a wrong way. And Apuala. How can? How can you be done with this marriage? Because of simple misunderstanding. Or maybe because she's not giving you children. Yes. And you are not even she's not giving, she has not because she will still give her giving definitely children. mama i don't care whatever expectations anybody has of me i don't care you see this one i am not going back on my decision i, can see I am done with this marriage mama i am not going to do it if she follows me you i will kill her i will kill her Mama, this is my life. This is my life. I, I, I'm supposed to live it the way I want it. The way, the way, the way I, I determine it. That's the way I will live it. On the dear, on the dear, calm down. You are begging, you are begging yourself. You are begging yourself. I am done with you. Madam Abuchi, Madam Abuchi, come down. 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 I can see clearly now. It is very obvious now that this is not all about patience. There is more to this issue. In fact, there is more to this matter than the patience we are looking at here. Tell him! I heard you now have a new neighbor in your compound. With whom you come back late every night. Two of us. Well, Papa, I know she must have told you people a lot of lies. It's, her, it's in her usual nature to gossip. She gossips in the morning, afternoon, and that is her work. So I do not care whatever she has told you. And if people have chosen to believe her, no problem. But you see this case, it is as good as over. Because this marriage, I am done with it. This marriage, come on, don't touch me. I say I am done with it. Don't ever, if I see you in my house, I will kill you by myself. Then I will kill you. You are my son. I will kill you. I am done with it. Mama, I am not going back to you. I will come to your house. Mama, I am not going back to you. I will come to your house. Mama, I am not going back to you. I will come to your house. Mama, I am not going back to you. 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 Have you seen that? Get me that stuff, have you seen that? Baby, please. You have to understand me. I've been going through a lot with that woman. Oh, please. Spare me that. You've been living okay with this woman before you met me. She's not the dove you think she is. She's not. I did what I did. Because of my own sanity. Please. I deserve to be with the woman I truly love. That woman is you. No, 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 no. Anytime you say this, it makes me feel embarrassed. It's so awkward. It's not right. It's not. I know it will be hard to convince you. I know it wouldn't seem right to you. Please, believe me, it's the necessary thing for me to do. You are decent, I know. You have character, you have understanding. 
That's what sets you apart. But even if it takes me forever to convince you, I will take forever to convince you. Life is, life is more spiritual than physical. It, it may not look right now, but it will. Believe me, it will. It will. I need you oh. to know that my happiness lies with you. I need to be happy. Why? Why on earth are you being so difficult? Why? My sister, I am so shocked by this news. I don't believe this. How on earth can your husband give the devil a chance in his home? No, 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 no. This is not the time for you to cry. You don't have to give the devil a chance in your home for crying out loud. Enough is enough. God has given us a mandate. We are more than conquerors. And you're crying. It is not the right thing to do. It is not. God is the way, the truth, and the life. He will make sure His words come to pass in our lives. Please, this is the time for you to go down on your knees and cry out to your Maker for Him to make things right. Yes, this night you are going to start a midnight prayer, and I am joining you. Yes, I will join you. And we will do it together. And believe me, we will come out victorious. Don't cry. This is not right at all. I am not happy that you are crying. I am not. Please, just go down on your knees and cry out to God. He will definitely answer you. Okay, my dear. I will see you soon. Alright, take care. My dear, he is not giving up. I have never seen such a man in my entire life. You need to hear the way he's sounding as if his life depends on me being his wife. Ito. Seriously, he sent his wife back here. Yes. She's no longer living with him. This is so unbelievable. Because of you. Well, um, he said... Uh, he has been having issues with his wife and all that, but I doubt, I don't know. I can't say I'm the one. I doubt. Do they have a child together? No, they don't. Oh. No, they don't. I don't think so. They don't. I think so. I doubt. Please. No, they don't. They don't. If they don't, <laughs> then he might be right. But I believe if you have any feelings for him at all, I mean any feelings. Things may work out contrary to your fears. You never can tell. See, babe, this life no get manual. You just shine your eyes. Grab it. Hello, beautiful. Hi. Hello, Aki. Hello, Annabelle. How are you, beautiful? You're welcome. Thank you. Welcome, lover boy. Thank you, Annabelle. I like that. Thank you. <laughs> hey, I got this for you. It's, um,. I don't know, but well, you like it. Come on, Alex. You mustn't buy gifts each time you're coming here. Did you hear your friend? I mustn't buy gifts. You know, that's my problem with her. The only problem actually I have with her because every time I want to show her how beautiful she is and what she means to my life, she thinks I'm just saying words without meaning. 
She doesn't know. She doesn't want to believe that she's my life, actually. I really want her to know that. I will keep doing this. I don't care how you feel about it. And I really don't give a hoot what anybody thinks about life. After all, there comes a time in every man's life when he's got to face it. He doesn't have to care what anybody will say. Anaba, maybe you can help me beg her. Talk to her for me. I understand. I can see it in your eyes. But you also have to understand that this is not easy for her. She's a human being and a woman. But trust me, with time she'll make up her mind. Please, help me and talk to her. Um, I know how I feel about her. And I know it's from the depth of my heart. I can see it in your eyes. Thank you. <laughs> Let me run around, ladies. I just dropped by to okay. give you this. Thank you anyway. I, I appreciate it. See, I know how you feel when I give you gifts. But it wouldn't stop me from giving you gifts. It's from my heart. It's the way I feel. It's the feelings you bring out in me. Okay? Let me run along. Ah, thanks for stopping by. Alright. Bye. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. 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 See? See what I was just telling you about. I see. Baby, don't enter. Hey, let's fast forward. Who would love me like this? Come and take me, please. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, it belongs to you. <laughs> you have to deal with it, babe. My daughter, it is strange that up till now you are still single. Let's go and visit that strong prophet. Eh? I am worried now. Mama, is it my fault that all the suitors that have been coming to me have one excuse or the other? You know my reservations about these prophets and their likes. Mama, there is nothing unusual about relationships not leading into marriage. There is nothing. Mama, please take it easy with me. When the right time comes, I will get married. Huh? If I can say, Kirigi, this prophet, this prophet, the same thing happened to me. It was a strong prophet that prayed and delivered me before your father came. My daughter, I am worried. Can you get me Eh? Mama, you need to calm down. Hmm? Trust your daughter on this one. I will get married sooner. I promise you. I, I don't need to see any prophets or offer any sacrifice before I get married. Just trust me on this one. Sooner it will happen. Imagine the way she's saying it as if she kept one man somewhere. Mama, I said okay, trust oh. on this one. if you said so, I believe you. But I really want to carry my grandchild. Mama, you will carry your grandchild. Yeah? Calm down. Is that why you don't want to offer me food? How can you cook offer food? You can't get them, but you can't food. Ever entered your life. 
We don't have to think about it too much. We don't owe the world any explanation. I guarantee you, I will love you every single day of our lives together. I cross my heart. You had to do all this before. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please be my wife. You don't give up, do you? Not for the woman my heart truly really beats for. You deserve a man that will worship you all your life. I truly adore you. See, say yes to me. Yes. Yes, I'm ready. Just give me life. And I promise I won't take this love for granted. Never. I love it. Thank you for choosing. In a thousand years. And it's a thousand times I'll still choose you. Thank you, thank you, my brother. Thank you, thank you. Hey, thank you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. for the happiness I see on the face of my daughter. <laughs> She's my everything. I know. I believe you take proper care of her. Mama, <laughs> I will take proper care of her. In fact, I should be the one thanking you for bringing such beauty and brain into the in world. Quoi? Yes, yes. And Mama, I also want you to thank her for me. Because her accepting me into her life has fulfilled my life desire. Yes. I find I find I so much find fulfillment in the love that I share with her. And yeah. I want to promise you something, Mama. I will love her every single day of my life. Mm -hmm. I will. Also, Mama much quality Nina. Yes, she's the joy I, I have found. My son. <laughs> Thank you for being that husband she has been waiting for. <laughs> Where are you from? Yes, Mama, I'm from Owanta. And your parents? They are alive and well. In fact, I plan to consult them as soon as possible so that we can um, communicate to you a convenient date. We will um, come together and uh, fulfill other traditional rights. Hello? Yes, Mama, I really want to do it as quickly as possible. Can you hear what's the Yes. Okay. Ozubo, Ozubo. Oh, the mama is son. I am happy with the good news. Thank you. My daughter. Yes. Hold each other very well. Hmm? I see both of you going places. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Hmm? Thank you very much, mama. Mama, I just, uh, we just wanted to inform you first so that I can move into his apartment. But we'll come back after you must have informed the mm. elders and other relatives. I'm happy for you. Thank you. My Anna. daughter. Thank you for making your mommy proud. <laughs> thank you. Hey. Mommy, thank you so much. My son. You. you are welcome again. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Nice. Wow. Very relaxing. Visualize so many other places. Mm -hmm. uh, 
taking you around the world. This can just put me to sleep. That's the idea. Mm -hmm. Darling. Yep. I hope the people will not have my head on a stick. <laughs> That's never gonna happen. My people understand and they respect my decision. So there's nothing to worry about. I'll talk to them next week. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hmm, that's so romantic, you know. <laughs> <laughs> that's because your beauty is irresistible. <laughs> I'm just starting with you, you know. Mm -hmm. By the time I'm done with you, you know that some guys are just so romantic. <laughs> Once I get my promotion, mm -hmm. hmm, I take my leave. We're touring the world, starting with Dubai. Hey, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna kill me with TLC? Please don't do because my heart is fragile. I'll try. Okay. I'll try. If your beauty would let me. <laughs> yeah. I'll try. Okay. But then. I know your beauty won't let me, so you have it coming your way. The TLC. <laughs> oh. You fulfill my dreams, baby. All my fantasies. Mm -hmm. Like, when I stare at you like this, I just. The world, the beauty of the world flashes right in my eyes. You know, I can't stop looking at you. <laughs> Don't cover your face <laughs> on me now. You know, initially I was really scared. But um, I'm glad we're here. I'm grateful you gave in to me because I'm just wondering what my life would have been if you had completely said no. I'd have lost all the happiness I would be having now. Thank you for choosing me. Thank you for having me. <laughs> you are the real MVP. <laughs> mm, guess what? Uh, um, okay. You want me to be, get you something? No, another guess. Um. You want to buy something for me? <laughs> no. Okay, let me just tell you. Mm. You'll be very happy. Spirit. Our first night. My first night with you. It was fruitful. That's why we're here. It was fruitful. It brought us here, right? No. I mean... I am five weeks gone. You don't say. Mm -hmm. You have a baby here. Junior is there. Come here! <laughs> Come here! What the fuck? Hmm? Wait. Mm -hmm. You're pregnant. Goodness. Death. A dead baby! <laughs>
I'm talking to you. Who are you? How did you get in here? I'm talking. Are you serious? This letter is for you, sir. Oh. It's from the head office. Really? Yeah. Thank you. Uh, none for me? <laughs> none for now. Wow. This one that came is just for him. So maybe later. Your promotion has finally come from the head of his. <laughs> what is it? Suspension letter. How? What happened? That you are being investigated for misappropriation of fund. And I should get ready to answer the invitation from the EFCC. Where are all these coming from? This is the height of problems. I am utterly confused. I really suggest you go see the RMG with this letter. There must be a mix up somewhere. I advise you go see him now.
Hello, baby. Really? You buy a car? for this baby it's it's good news I'm happy for the development I'm not at the office I'm at home I've been suspended from work they froze my account and they are subjecting me to EFCC investigation. I know. I don't know. I'm just I'm just confused. Just confused. Thank you for this crepe bandage. Thank you. Please, it will hold it well. Yes, it is my duty. I know. Thank you. It's going to go down well with this leg. Um, the mom. Hmm? I am not happy. Ha. Why? It's not because of this leg. But what? Patient. Oh. Patient. Yes. Patience is machuating seriously. She's going down day by day. I fear her health may be affected. And that wouldn't be nice. That girl is a very good girl. Hmm? Honey dear, what do you want me to do exactly? Hmm? What do you want me to do? Alex, our son, has vehemently turned deaf ear to his parents' advice and pleadings. One dear, I don't want to receive any disrespect or insult from my own son again. I don't want it. I tell me, you, Mama, please. Biko, forgive him. I know what he did was very wrong. Forgive him. He's still our son. I know what he yeah, did was if very, what very you wrong. are saying is that I go to the city to see him. Mm -mm, it won't work. But that's exactly what I'm trying to let you know. It will not work. I won't go. Please, we just have to do that. If not for anything, for the sake of this, our daughter-in-law. For the sake of patience. This girl is another man's child. The mama. You know, if not because of this, my leg pain. First thing tomorrow morning, I would have been there. But I cannot. Because I can't sit in the vehicle. The leg will pain me more. You just have to help. Eh? Only dear. Okay. 
afraid you. I will go to the city and see him. But my problem is, is, is the, the insolence and the impunity with which this boy threw my words back at me. That is, that is, that is where my heart is broken. I know, I know. But please, forgive him. Why, Alia? He's our son. I know he will come back to his senses one day. Oh? Okay. No problem. You know what? Um, you know what will happen? Mm. Tomorrow morning. Mm. First thing tomorrow morning. Mm. I'll go to the city to see him. Mm? Yes. I can do anything for you just to make you happy. Thank you. I will leave very early so that I can return and attend my meeting with the... With the, the oh no, woman. it's yes. true, it's true. Yes. Darling, oh, uh -huh. thank you. Look at me, my name is Oku Erika. Darling. My love, you have to snap up on this place. Snap out, snap out. Mm. You have to take it easy on yourself. Hmm? Take it. Just calm down. You will be fine. We will be fine. Hold on, I'm coming. You're welcome. Thank you. Where is my son? He is inside. Please come in. Papa. You're welcome, Papa. Good morning. Please. Good morning. You're welcome, Video sir. Video unannounced. Yeah. Papa, please sit. I wasn't expecting you. This is so unannounced. Uh, so I have to write application and wait for your approval before I come to your house. Is that it? That is not what I mean. I just... It's okay. Please, what do we offer you? Linda, I don't want anything. I don't have appetite for anything at all. Hello, Who is she? Um, <clears throat> well, Papa, um, there's um, there's actually no need to beat about the bush. I I already planned that I was going to come to the village next week mm -hmm. to see you and Mama um, concerning her. Um, her name is Linda. Um, she's the woman I want to get married to. I want to make her my wife. You want to make her your wife? Yes. In a clear language. She must be the lady, your legitimate wife, made mention of that you have been, you have been frolicking with. Do you want to make her a second wife? I never made mention of a second wife, Papa. I said I want to marry her. I want to make her my wife. Just listen to yourself. Just listen to yourself talk. Have you forgotten that you were legally married? Have you? Papa, if patients and her people want to return the bride price, by all means they should return it already. Because I, 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 I am not considering that as marriage anymore. I will file the necessary papers in court when, as quickly as possible. So I've, I've counted it off already. Mother Pichuku. Mother Buchuku. Papa. Mother Buchuku. Papa. I called you three times. I called you how many times? Three times. You rubbished my words a lot of times in the past. 
as your father. And this time, I am not going to give you that opportunity again. I came here because your mother believes you can still be responsible. But I can see the reverse is being the case here. I'm going to be very brief because I can't see myself sleeping under this roof with your mistress when your legitimate wife is under my roof crying herself to sleep every night. Madam Bujuku, the earlier you come to your senses, the better for you. Listen to this. An elder dies when he refuses to give a sound counsel to the young. And the young equally dies when he refuses to heed the sound counsel of the elder. But it's obvious nobody wants to understand me. It's obvious nobody wants to understand me. If you want to go, go. Nobody wants to listen to me. Nobody wants to know how I feel. She's the woman I will get married to and there's nothing anybody can do about it. What is all this? That's why you keep frustrating me up and down. Do you know the pain I've feel, I felt in the last few days? Do you know how painful it's been for me? But you know you care about is what that gossip tells me in the village. I'm tired of all this. I'm tired of life.
darling. My Nika just arrived. <laughs> What's the problem? Why are you crying? Then why are you crying? The car got snatched at some point today. Oh my god. Have you called the police? I called them. And she said that's really this. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, darling. It's okay. What's this? EFCC. Wait, what's going on here? How did this happen? I don't know. I don't know it yet. I'm just tired. It's okay. Don't be too hard on yourself. Why is you not following him about? Babe, if you ask me, these are early warning signs. Wait. You think so? Yes. Listen, girl. He has not done anything concrete on you yet. You have to use your tongue and count your teeth now that there is, there is still time. Are you suggesting I leave him at this critical point of his life? God. Baby, it seems you still don't understand what all this is all about. By the time his case with the EFCC gets underway, that's when you realize that this boutique you are in is linked to him. My God, you know I didn't think it. You are right. Oh my God, I don't want any kind of trouble. I don't have strength for this. Babe! I never thought of it. You're right. Oh my God, I don't want any problem. I don't have strength for any, any kind of problem. Not now that I'm even pregnant. What? What do I do? Pregnant? Yes. Linda, you did tell me. I didn't know. I just got to find out. No, this is bad. Okay, calm down. Take it easy. How old is the baby? Six weeks. You need to terminate it at once. Yes, this ship is sinking fast. You have to save yourself first before saving another. This task they say is the key. Thank God you two are not yet husband and wife. It's, it's still not a big deal. But I don't know what to do. I don't know what to think. My head is full. Why too? Tell me my head is full. Oh my God, no, no. This is bad. Oh. This is... What is it? My son is in danger. God forbid. My son is in danger. Makanda, what is it? Hi. Hey. Hey. I saw it. He's in danger. Makanda, hey. God forbid. Madam hey. Brachu. That's the description of our new neighbor. What do? Wait. Did you say he wants to marry? Yes, Papa. Hey. What, what, what kind of problem is this one now? What is this? Jesus. What is this? Jesus. Eh? Yeah, please. You need to take me to the city. I, I, I want to talk to my son. I must go to the city. My son is in danger. What is this? Come down. 
coming down. No. Don't aggravate your people. Papa, this is not about coming down. We need to go and save my husband. Hey. Though. He's in danger. What? Hey. Ah, my son. Oh, yeah. That's my friend. Yes, yes. Oh, I got friend. They have real My son is in danger. Mama, no, no, she's the one giving me update about Mother Buchuku. Mm -hmm. Name, welcome. Mm -hmm. So good afternoon. Mama, no. patient. Your husband is in great danger. Hey! Which is why I'm here. Yes, Mama. The you will have food. to forgive him and get back to him no matter I what. Him, Mama, the lady he's staying with has a spiritual husband. And the, 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 the devil in he is willing to destroy him no matter what. Anybody that comes hey, close to him, I said you have to forgive him and get back to him. Hey. I knew that that white hey. hey. lady was a witch. I knew her color was not hey. normal. Hey. Take me to the city. I need me. to send my son. It's okay, man. Hey. Come on. Papa, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not in the mood for those kind, any kind of talk now. What is it? Papa, please don't, 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 don't allow me to insult you. Don't, don't, don't allow me to insult you. What, what, what is this nonsense now? Why are you calling me for, for this kind of rubbish? If you know the kind of pains that I'm going through here, yeah, you will not be calling me on the phone to tell me all, all the useless gossip that persons is peddling around me, about, about me in the village. I'm not going for this nonsense though. Please, don't, don't, don't just call me again. Don't. God, I've been trying to get hold of you. Yes, please. I want you to be at a lab. Tomorrow. Yes. As soon as he leaves the house, I will call you. Girl, yes, now I want you to I want you to help me drive my second car. Yes, I want to park it in your house. And I'll also pick some stuff from the house. I don't want to get back to the house until I know his face. Yes. Please just hold your phone. I don't want to hear low battery or anything like that. Thank you so much. Yes. Take care.
Something is not gone. Calls waiting for you. For me? Waiting for me for? To drop me off at the EFCC. Oh, babe, I'm sorry. I, I cannot take you there. Baby, I'm really scared. Please try and understand. No, you don't have to be scared. I mean, it's me they want to see. Not you. It's not about you. Okay? It's just, I, I, I'll just go there and I believe they will find out that I'm innocent. There's nothing for you to worry about. My love, the thing is, I've not even been to a police station before. I, let alone EFCC. I, I might faint when I get there. <sighs> It's okay, all right? I don't want you feeling scared, all right? I'll drive myself. Which of the cars will I be using? Which one do you want to use? Uh, uh, my love, what if they confiscate it when you get there? You know, confiscate? My, yes, my own opinion, I would advise you go with a cab. Yes, so they will look at you like an average man or below average. Don't you think so? Okay, I, I never really saw it that way, but um, I think it makes sense, so they don't start um, suspecting exactly. other things. Okay, no problems, but baby, I need you to be strong. Don't feel scared because of this, okay? I am totally innocent. And I believe they will find out that I am because I never took one cobble from the company's coffers. Please, I just know, I don't want you to start worrying your head. This will surely pass. I'm trying to be strong about this and I need you to be strong too. Okay? I believe you, my love. I do. May God fight for you. I love you. I love you too. Hi. Are you okay? My heart. What happened to your heart? It's nothing. Are you sure? I felt a sharp pain there, but it's gone. It's gone. Let me. Let me head up. Okay? Okay. You leaving now? Uh, no, 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 no. I'm not leaving now. I'll. I'm still around. Be strong. I will. I'll see you soon. Okay. Hope. You're fine. I'm fine. Okay. Don't worry, I'll see you later. Okay, good okay? luck. Take care of you. He should have closed by now. Now, what is the time? Hmm? Then what is he saying? Is he ringing? He's not taking my call. Dad, don't be again. I am. Check the other way. 
What is he saying? Mm, is he He's not taking my calls. He's still declining. Do you have your time? I don't. I don't even call. I did not even come with my phone. This is not nice. Oh, yeah, I said, I'm not the boy again. 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 I don't come down. 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 Come down.